Good morning, everybody. Vlogmas Day 31. Hope everybody's doing well. Yeah, what is today? Is it Wednesday? Yeah, today is... Is it Wednesday? I think so. Yeah, Wednesday. It is Wednesday. It's the last day of the month, so y'all say a prayer for me. Today is the toughest day of the month for me. Yeah. Pray my computer is behaving. Yesterday, well, I, I had my computer upgraded. Well, one of the guys in the back, his computer was not working. It, it was an original computer. It's old. It needs to be replaced. So, I called my IT guy to get him a new computer. Hang on. Okay. And my car is on E. We make it to the gas station. I meant to do that yesterday. Yeah, my husband gets so mad at me when I run my car low. Um, but anyways, I called my IT guy because he needed a new computer. And well, first I called him, I was thinking about fixing his computer and I was like, you know what? I've been having some issues with mine. Why don't I get a new computer and he gets my other one? Cause this salesman is usually out on the road. He's not on the computer all the time like I am. Like I depend, I have to be able to email. That's how I get my bills out, or my, you know, my invoicing out. But anyways, my IT guy's like, no, Nancy, you have a nice computer. We'll just upgrade yours. And I said, look, it seems like every time I come to work, it just seems that way, but it does happen frequently. I can't. I got an issue, and I'm tired of it. I, I want a computer. When I sit down, it works. So he's like, well, let me look at it. You know, now this guy's worked for me from day one, but he made a little more of an effort. So, so the, they said the problem was is my um, Outlook email was never upgraded to... I don't know, Windows 11 or whatever, and I'm like, well, uh, you guys are my IT guys, you're the one, I mean, everything I have is recommended by them, I have a server, I mean, everybody used to write off my computer, now I have a server, so everybody's independent, you know, things should run smoother, well, yeah, no, <laughs> oh, anyways, I decided, He's, I guess he's upgraded my computer. It should be like Daytona 500 ready, right? I get into work yesterday and um, when I send when I send an invoice or credit to a customer, there's a message in there in my QuickBooks and I could not for the life of me figure out how well, what happened was my signature disappeared, and I, you know, I figured out how to do the signature, but it kept going on top of the message and not below the message. It was like, maybe it's an OCD thing, but I think it's a wrong thing. It needs to be done right. Well, nobody could figure it out. He said I had to call QuickBooks. QuickBooks couldn't figure it out. Well, anyway, so my IT guy goes in there, and he, he fiddles around, and he says, Nancy, why don't we just, you know, do this and whatever. Well, ended up, my logo disappeared on my invoicing. And the only way I realized that was I have one customer I spoil. I have more than one. But there's some of these contractors, they don't have bookkeepers. So, I guess I'm, I'm technically their bookkeeper <laughs> on the door side of things, the window side of things. So, what I do is I keep... I, I put all their invoices in a folder in the last day of the month. I email it to them and I mail it to them. So I printed out an invoice for this guy, for one of my contractors that I spoil. And I noticed that the logo was gone. If I had not done that, I would have never known. Cause I don't see that end of it. I just see the invoice and who it goes to, but the actual printout, I mean, I do print them out when a delivery ticket comes in and attached. But anyways, to make a long story short, it messed up my logo and I could not figure it out. And it changed the late, it, like when you go to invoice, it says invoice. When you go to credits, it says credits. This said my 
designed credit. I'm like, where the heck did that come from? Oh my God, it was a nightmare. And finally I'm like, look, don't we back up? Can't we get an old file and just modify the template? I just don't know how to do it. Well, yeah, so they decided to do that. Oh my God. 5.30 rolls around, finally. So, this morning better go smooth. Yeah, because I was not happy. I was a little snippy with my IT guy. There's one of my trucks. I have a wonderful driver, his name is Wayne. He used to work at the prison and he got tired of that. He retired from the prison. He came to work for me. I love him. He's so laid back. He's, he's my jolly driver. <laughs> uh, his wife knits and crochets. Yep. Which I thought was kind of cool. There was something else I wanted to talk to you guys about. Well, the whip of the day, I got it in my cinnamon stitches bag. I don't know what she's calling these bags, but I'm gonna call it my cinnamon stitches bag. But um, I got my amigurumi. I gotta sew its body parts on. <laughs> and I forgot the stuffing. Oh my goodness. I gotta get gas first. I never let my car get this low. If I run out of gas, I'm gonna be in so much trouble. Like, it's on E. E! And see, last night, about midnight, I could not download yesterday's video, so I got in my car at midnight, and I drove to the office in the parking lot and I sat there in the parking lot waiting for my car to download because I have good internet there and it was starting to download. And then I looked down and it was like, I've been like sitting there running on fumes. And then I drove, when I left, the gas stations were closed. So I drove home on fumes and now I'm driving to work on fumes. Yes. <laughs> we're almost there guys. I'm gonna stop at the Shell station. But, oh, and I'm speeding and there's a cop in front of me. Actually, I'm not speeding, but I needed to slow down. Oh, good. There is. There's the pump available. Okay, guys. Have a wonderful day. Maybe you'll see me later. I love y'all. Mwah.